What's up guys? Welcome to a new video. So today we are on the Skiller account. This is going to be my brand new Skiller. Uh, John is making one. I don't know if his video, I assume his video, if he's even making videos, will come out before mine. But either way, he's got a Skiller and I wanted to do one ever since the Polymyth came out. I'll show you that now. Uh, the Polymyth cape basically is a max cape for Skillers. It requires every 99 except for attack, health, strength, defense, range, prayer, and magic. It does include Invention, and it does include Slayer, so it's a pretty tough cape to get. I'm going to do it as an Iron Man to prove that it is possible without gaining any stats. So, what are the rules? What, what is the goal? So, obviously the goal is the Polymath cape. Now, the only rule I really have is you are not allowed to reset stats. You are allowed to lock stats, so you can do anything as a level 3, um, but I am not allowed to reset any stats via the Reset Genie in Edgeville. So... Uh, you'll probably see some uh, lock stats slam. I'm very curious to see how it goes. Obviously, I'm doing everything as a level three, so it's probably going to be very difficult. I'm definitely going to need a lot of food. Let's uh, let's get going. Let's skill. So, uh, I think for starters, we'll go with um, fishing. I'm not gonna. There's you can do it quickly if you spam click and all that, but I'm not really about that life. Um, oh, I forgot I'm an Iron Man. <laughs> Uh, okay, I could have gone to the general store. I think I just wasted all this time. Here in my store is general. Uh, nice. Let's get that. Let's get that. Let's get that. While we're here, let's get that. Let's get that. 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 And that. Anything? I don't think I need one of those, but just in case. I don't need that either. I should be good on everything else. Yes. Okay. Alright, so I'm going to start fishing. Yo, so I just got a hard clue bottle. We actually have some cash, so let's just buy a... Uh, let's buy a freaking uh, magic oyster and open this thing. Uh, I don't know what we would... Could, I don't know. Whatever. Let's open it. Uh, I've got a boater. Uh, I guess. <laughs> I guess. I guess, you know, we'll just keep this for when we have uh, an old X device so we can disassemble. Not bad, I suppose. Yeah, 99, 99 fishing. <laughs> let's go get the cape and come back here and probably still... Well, do I need a fish? You know, let's, let's go do a new skill. Let's look at And uh, before I end the clip, mystery box. 15 instance tokens. That's super useful to me. Oh, that's sad. Somehow I got two mystery boxes in my inventory. No clue how. Don't know no, how. Uncut Onyx and 50 Love Dragon Balls. I'll, I'll take that shit. Alright, so I got a bunch of clues. Let's open up these clues. Get some, uh, can I buy Magic Eyes from Misha? You can. And I love how I got just random minnows. Fishing is super not broken. Alright, I don't even know what I would want from these. I really, yeah, I don't know if there's like a single thing I would even care about from these. What? Clue scrolls, like the lower tier ones. Oh. Um, cool. Alright, so I just made a bunch of bronze darts, and I think fast weapons are actually going to be the best weapons to use. I, uh, let's get, I can actually let's put some of this back on, so you, 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 just for, for looks. We're going to kill some cows. Um, why kill cows? We're a drop table. I already did a couple. It didn't work. It wasn't bad, but it just wasn't great with Iron Skin Tower. So we're going to try it again, but this time with the um, Bronze Darts. So my dream goal for this account, one of my big, big real goals, is Rapier and Infernal Cape. Because they both have no requirements to be weld. Uh, so the Pug Points is how I'm going to get the Rapier. And then with the Donator Store, I'm going to use my Donator Points. I get from Bonds and whatnot to purchase the Infernal Cape. So, it should be uh, pretty uh, fun. It's going to take a while to get there, um, and I'm definitely going to be camping a lot of rare drop table loops and whatnot. So, as you can see, no experience because we've locked our experience, so we can only gain skill in these rooms. And again, this is allowed for me. If you want to do it, however you want to do it, have at it. I know some people, what they do is they reset their stats, and uh, this is the other alternative. I think this is more entertaining, at least to me. So I'm going to do it. I just got a dark stone and a uh, small fishing bottle. As you can see, fishing is really, really good. These are all clues. We got this from Mystery Box, this from Mystery Box, the pure cash. Uh, it's awesome. 
<laughs> it just happened again. Medium clue and then a uh, dark stone. That's so awesome. All right, so let's uh, let's probably end the. Let's probably end it for tonight. Open up all these clues. See if we can't get anything good. Uh, again, I don't know what we would want. We'll just have to see. You know what I mean? I don't know. I have nothing in specifics. But uh, let's uh, hard four mediums, five easies. All right, mediums. Oh, some atoms in there were invisible. I don't know if anything in that lot is useful to me. Ah, uh, so this way. I guess we have one hard. That's nice. I get some money back. Cool. I'm, I'm happy with that. I'm very happy with that. I spent a little bit of money to open these, so to make some of it back, you know. I'm happy with that. Uh, yeah, cool. Hammer Pet, yay! It takes forever for the recorder to upload, so whenever I get a pet, it's like, yay! There's a reaction, and then there's ten minutes of, looking, of waiting for this thing to fucking upload, or load. And then by the time it does load, I have no reaction because it's already passed. But, uh, yeah. Alright, so just, uh, been fishing. Uh, I'm probably gonna be doing a lot of fishing, like I said. You get a lot of cash, just, this is all, look, like, look, this is not even a part of my main cash stack, so that's all my, uh, that's all from that inventory. You get tons of clue scrolls. Uh, still working on the first, ang the first, um, complete set of angler. We got another dark stone, adds a collection. We ended up getting a pet, as you saw. Start a pet tab. Probably put the pet tab second. Can you not remove tabs? Well, there's one way to do it. This tab over here, I'm just going to keep the like, cosmetics and whatnot. It's just cosmetic stuff that I'd like to keep, something like that. Alright, so we got a ton of clues. Let's open these up. So I have two master clues. Unfortunately, they both require gilded, which is something that I'll never be able to do. Um, whenever you get a clue box, the, cl the uh, clue that it gives you is always this one. So odds are we're going to end up with a million of these. There's, I think there's two clues I can do. One of them I can do any at any time because it's the one where you talk to people. And then the second one requires a, uh, a little bit more. I have to get some lucky items from here, such as cat mask and a katana. But let's, uh, let's go with it. I'm also, I don't know if you've noticed, I am collecting some of the god pages. Because I, I think that those books are definitely wieldable, so why not, right? Uh, they'll have stats. Uh, looking for a katana from hards, and then a cat mask from mediums, and then nothing from easy, so we'll just spam open. You know, that's not bad. We got pantaloons, which, uh, just messing up. We got pantaloons, we got a lot of pages, so I'll take it. Or not pantaloons, flare trousers. Alright, so I traded in some things, spent some points, five mystery boxes. Uh, my first, like, immediate goal is rapier. That's, like, the main thing I want, so I'm not really focused too much on Slayer. And um, I did a cow task. That was perfectly fine. We got 29 Slayer from that. So I'm honestly not worried about Slayer as much as other people are. Uh, mystery boxes. That's cool. It's rare components. Keep it as a cosmetic for a little while. That's pure cash. That's some crystal components. We can open up one of those keys. Um, you can get membership and bonds and stuff from that. So yeah, definitely worthwhile. Everything on this is probably the only thing that's not worth anything. Hey, so I'm doing some fishing. I got a mystery box. Boom, Serato and Sword. I think... Yes, I'm right. It doesn't have requirements. We've got ourselves a very nice weapon. Um, so this account's going to be weird because obviously these are things I should probably fix. I'm sort of torn between if I want to fix them or what. Because realistically, they don't affect the game in any way. It's not like level 3's having a Ceridoman sword ruins the game for anyone in particular. I think if anything, it's going to make my series interesting. So... We'll see. I'm not going to do anything yet. I'm going to get your feedback. We're going to actually try a little bit more of the PVM right now. We've got this thing. We've got ourselves a fire cape because I bought an untradeable box. I know what you're thinking. Can I wear these? No, I can't, unfortunately. The rest of this stuff will just disassemble. Uh, we also got the crystal halberd, which does that have requirements? It does. Okay. Let's, uh, let me gear up and we're going to go try some cows. You know what? I actually just got a man task. Uh, that didn't update. Let's do freaking men. They're not, like, I mean, they're essentially the same thing as cows. They have the same chance of rare drop table and all of that, and they're easy to kill. Let's, uh, just kind of want to see what this looks like. Let's smack a couple. We have special, special attack, too. So as you can see, we're not sliding. We're just going to one-shot them as level three. It's still not great. I think rapier is definitely going to be insane because of how fast it is. 
I definitely expect that to, to be the, the best weapon. But even with all of this strength bonus and whatnot, this... <laughs> you know, we're not one-shotting these or anything like that. Special attack should be pretty good. Let's, let's spec this thing. What, on what server are you doing this, right? <laughs> look at that. Oh, look at that one shot. That one shot potential now. Ooh, dragon dart tips. Rare drop table. There we go. Nice. So I just got a pair of dragon boots. Dragon boots are actually good because uh, primordials don't have any requirements. For whatever reason, whenever I did, whenever I coded primordials, I never gave them requirements because I'm lazy. And, uh,. This is obviously one of the first parts of getting the uh, the boots, so that's very nice to have locked out of the way. You can just let that chill in this corner. Um, actually, killing rock crabs pretty good. I didn't think that rock crabs would be that great to kill, but they're they're honestly not that bad. Obviously, I'm not going to be you know killing them as as quickly as I would be killing cows or anything. So, rare drop table isn't as great on these, but um, Slayer experience is based off of combat level, and obviously these are I, why am I saying obviously so many times. Uh, these are 13, so, you know, I think it's the best I can kill. There's other tasks you can get on the easies, such as Hill Giants and Black Knights, but I think that those might be too hard. So I'm going to stick with these tasks for now, at least until I get better gear, such as, like, Raybeer. Okay, so I just recorded a clip, and I did not have audio on. Uh, basically, I got three bonds from doing Hide and Seeks with John, with that John was hosting. Uh, they were all legit. You guys did them earlier today. I'm sure you'll remember this whenever you're watching this video. And you'll know that I am indeed fresh. I actually have like a video already recorded. I just don't want to release it because then people will know my name. And it's really nice to just chill. And you get a really, you can like really look on and spy on people. I can see how good my staff are constantly teleporting me to find out if I'm botting. I'm not. Leave me alone. But it doesn't matter because by the time you're seeing this video, you already know. So, uh, anyways, <laughs> I also completed the Zami book, which has a nice. Plus eight to all of the offenses. Oh, right, and then the fishing kip has... I was wondering, I thought that the fishing kip had offense as well. Um, I can't wait to get the fi the, the uh, master cape. The fishing master cape is going to be really nice. It's actually better than a... Um, it's better than a uh, freaking fire cape. I have, I have decided that instead of using pug points to buy the rapier, I'm actually going to buy it with donator points because we got those bonds. We're only uh, 2,500 away from getting the rapier, and I think the rapier is definitely the main thing we want. Sword's nice but the rapier is going to be nicer.